Wow, Easter weekend. It's got to be one of the best weekends ever. Not because of the Easter bunny, Easter eggs, or anything else, which is not real anyway, but because of what the weekend represents to us. Jesus was crucified and he was buried and on the third day he rose again. His precious blood that he shed on the cross paid the debt that we could not pay and the debt that he did not owe. He lived a sinless life, yet he came down from heaven, born of a virgin. He lived a sinless life, yet he became our sacrifice so that all who believe in him will have eternal life, which is a free gift from God. Wow. It's just amazing. He had 39, 39 lashings. 40 lashings is enough to kill a man, but they wanted him alive. So he got 39 lashings and he had to carry his cross all the way to where they were going to crucify him at Golgotha. It's amazing this year, um, Easter, or which we don't call it Easter, well, I don't, uh, I call it the Resurrection. Uh, weekend, Sunday, Resurrection Sunday, which is tomorrow. Today is obviously in between. Um, yesterday, there was, it was a beautiful day. There was over, over 29 new baptisms um, between Sydney and Melbourne with Harvest Team and I watched it online. I was going to go down there but I couldn't make it so I watched it online and it was absolutely amazing to see these people just give their life to Jesus. Wow. Praise the Lord. So that was awesome to watch. And <coughs> if you want to have a look, you can see it on harvest.com.au, I believe that's the website. Um, so, yeah, um, it was a wonderful, powerful day that Jesus, oh, wow, what he went through for us. He had this crown of thorns shoved on his head and he was bleeding all over his body from the, the crown of thorns digging in to his scalp and from all the lashings that he had and he was beaten and he was he would have been for a normal person no we couldn't do it but he did it because he loves us and he was going to be the sacrifice for us. He paid it all for our sins. He paid the debt that we cannot pay because he loves us so much. Jesus is real. Jesus loves you so much. 
if you haven't done so already, believe in Jesus. Ask him to forgive you of your sins, and he will. And he will cover you with his precious blood. And he will welcome you to the family of God. And very soon Jesus is going to come back to take us home before the seven year tribulation. Now tomorrow being Resurrection Sunday, that's the day that he was resurrected when they went to the tomb, Mary and I, uh, it was Mary Magdalene. Uh, she went to the, the tomb with herbs and spices and the stone was rolled away, <laughs> the huge stone. And she was so upset because she thought that someone had stolen Jesus and taken him away somewhere. But Jesus was there and she didn't recognise him because of her tears. And he said, woman, what are you looking for? And she said, Messiah. And then she realised that it was him. And she went and told everybody, all the disciples. And Jesus showed himself. Over 500 people actually witnessed Jesus being resurrected. And then he went... And ascended to the Father. And he's coming back. He is coming back. He is coming back very soon. And he loves you so much. I hope that you have an awesome weekend. Jesus loves you. And he wants you to go to heaven he wants you with him give your life to Jesus you won't regret it he gives you everything so much joy he looks after us you know I have been in situations where I thought I wouldn't be able to make ends meet but Jesus always seems to help us some way everything works out praise the lord praise the lord i have got so much to testify about which i will leave to another video but i just want to let you know that jesus loves you and have a blessed weekend Bye for now.